there is this thing called militarism. It has to do with the military industrial complex, it has to do with wars, it has to do with conflict, sexual violence. It comes out of the fact that we want more and therefore we are willing to fight for more and therefore then we need weapons to be able to ensure that we get more. It's very calculated, um, a lot of thinking goes into it. Militarism is the, the choice of, of death over life. conflict and uh, militarism are expressions of violence made natural. There are implications of, um, of that militarized violence on people's lives, whether it's women who have been raped and then who are then traumatized. You know, women's bodies have become the battlefield. You cannot live a normal everyday life when there are such visible tokens of militarism all around you. As a result of the contamination of our environment, our health status is greatly impacted. And one example of that is in the incredibly high rates of cancer in our community. States, uh, currently the uh, discretionary part of the federal budget, roughly 52% is going to the military. It's about $730 billion, more than $2 billion a day uh, this year. It's a huge capitalistic money-making enterprise. Somehow it is um, a response to this new um, entity that we call terror or you know the, the threat of terrorism and um, that therefore you have to, as you said, create a sense of security by arming yourself to the teeth. This diversion of resources to something that does not address the basic living needs of most people is, is not right. So more people need to know about it, more people need to talk about it, more people need to oppose it and to uh, put forward all kinds of alternatives. Uh, that's happening in small ways um, in this country and in many countries in the world. It needs to happen so much more.